Hey everyone, it's the Insane Botanist here. Now, we're at a noticeable time where I can say that we're at a noticeable temperature in Scoville heat units in peppers, and we would also fill a, a medium to large classroom. My hopes is that we fill a lecture hall in the end of this year. But that just depends on how many videos I post and how many people enjoy the videos I post. So if you know anyone that likes my, that may like my content, feel free to send them a link to one of my videos and see where it goes. Also, if you're finding this video and you're not subscribed, feel free to subscribe. I'm sure that I'll make videos you'll enjoy because I have eaten so many weird things and I have plans to try many different things. But anyways, I also wanted to make a comment that as it stands right now, the state of cannabis and hemp and CBD and all that sorts is getting to a point where I kind of think that this is going to be a year that's a major turning point for the cannabis industry. I mean, last year we had um, growing Belushi. We've gotten many states that have joined the bandwagon and kind of direction of decriminalizing slash legalizing marijuana or hemp, whether it's just CBD oil or all the way up to recreational marijuana, which I'd kind of consider the final point because you'd obviously start medicinal and then go to recreational. And the benefit of this is, well, based on my weed like to talk about it, is the people with like Parkinson's or uh, PTSD, anxiety, depression, um, I'm sure even like panic disorder, all sorts of things, and also like eczema, um, the list can go on and on really. I don't feel like listing every single ailment that could be eased or slash solved. I won't actually say that everything is going to be cured because legally I should not say that. But we're going in a direction where marijuana is becoming a kind of central medicine for people. Whether it's self-medicating, which is recreational, or through the advice of a medical professional, which is obviously the medicinal side of things. And really, I'm very interested in it as I made that video. And honestly, I may make another one where it's going to be going into a lot of the more recreational and medicinal side of things like CBG, um, CBD... CBN, and I mean, really, we've gotten research studies that have shown, I think it's CBDA and CBGA, of course they sound kind of similar, but they're the um, cannabinoid acid of CBD and CBG, and pretty much what happens is to convert it into CBG or CBD, it needs, I believe, sunlight or heat. So, when you harvest marijuana, when you heat it and decarb the stuff, it turns all of these um, A ending things into, um, well, CBD, CBG, CBN, THC, all that sorts of stuff. I don't necessarily know all the scientific side of things, but I'm sure I'm going to make a video on what each thing is and what they have been shown to solve. Well, anyways, this was a short video that I just wanted to put out because even though I am outside and currently freezing, I really felt like this was an important to do. And see you in the next one. Feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll make sure the next video is another fun one.